Hey, um, now we have a nice uh, um, group of people who have entered already. Good afternoon. So glad to see you. And after this hard working yesterday. And uh, it's um, again, it's Vesayona who will start. And uh, then we will change roles in a couple of hours. So perhaps Vesayona, you would start now. Yes, we can start. And as usual, just uh, people are coming a little bit uh, on their own time, but uh, we are starting. So let's see what we are doing today. Just a moment, a couple of things to be applied. And after that, I'm able to share content with you. I will close my phone so it won't interrupt me and let's go. So, uh, so the guys are saying that they are late because they're coming from the classes. So they have yes, classes. That's totally understandable. And you have all your day to day work to do. So it's totally fine. So here, so as always, we are working with this project and uh, this is already familiar slide for you. And let's go further for today's content. So today we have uh, this kind of agenda, have discussions, have some kind of brainstorming and talk about the techniques and the future for the website and uh, for the project in uh, general view that we get ideas how we can benefit and make best out of our collaboration during the spring. So as well as we know, uh, we have planned in early February, we have, will have the next week, next training week. And uh, our idea is that uh, on <coughs> that week, we will publish the website and we start training you to be multipliers of uh, these kind of these digital skills you have learned with us. And there are a couple of ideas we would like to share with you and we will come back for that in a wrap up today. But let's start the content. And uh, of course we are still, as we have agreed, uh, talking about this uh, website we are developing. And yesterday I gave you and a homework and ye, most of some of you have already returned it and we would appreciate that if you haven't done it yet please do it at some point after this training today or at any time good for you so we are still talking about the website at the first and in homework we had uh, some questions and I would like to share some of these ideas with you. And just a moment, I would like to take these visible here, just a moment. And uh, you should see now a Word document. Uh, could you someone confirm that for me? So yes, it's visible. Yes, good. Yes, it's visible. So basically I have got some answers for the question. And the first question was uh, that you should try to think how this all work you already have done uh, would benefit anyone using it. And there's, there were very good answers. And uh, especially I liked the idea that you want to share good practices, have some kind of transparency of information and uh, this kind of support thinking and collaboration thinking is a really good way to improve Moldovan setting in complete setting. 
So you are on a good way, we can have uh, ideas here and uh, easy distribution is really important. The second question were about uh, your personal views, how it would benefit especially you. And uh, it's good to see that you have some kind of need to have a platform, to have materials, to have ideas, to have some kind of special content and so on. You have needs that are not fulfilled at the moment in the Moldovan setting. And this website has this role in our mind as in a project that this will be your way to share and collaborate together. And it's going there step by step. We have still work to do, but it's going on that way. And the last comment here, professional and personal development in the field of communication, it's a really good point. Always when we are working, it should be talking about how we will develop and how we will get more skills and competencies to work, especially now when we are talking about the digital skills. Third question were about how should the website to be used to benefit others? Not you, but others. Uh, this could be a not so correct the translation I have used uh, uh, auto translate, but a rational and more explicit. Uh, I didn't get the point, what's the really point, but I'm having ideas what that could be meaning. Uh, there's good ways uh, to organize as they wish. There should be some flexibility. I'm, I totally agree with that, that you should have your own way to express your skills, your needs, and your information, because you are the subject leaders on these kind of uh, competencies, and you should have, you know the best way to communicate, best way to share things. And uh, there should be an easy access. So this is open website, so anyone can access there, and that's the good thing. And uh, to be promoted in all institutions, and that's, one plan we have for the spring, but we need to discuss it about it more in February. This is the thing we will return. We will uh, discuss about that and we should agree some kind of uh, work plan to uh, implement it in a Moldovan setting. Um, yes, and uh, if there's any other uh, any changes you would like to make? My personal favorite was that it's not on the topic, but I would like to sleep more. I need to comment. You have been so brave with us. You have done a great work, but do not exhaust yourselves. Do as much as you can, but do not go over your limits. Uh, and in a topic, of course, I would like to see this happen that you would, someone of you would like to add other sectors. This would be the great opportunity. It's not a thing at the moment, but it's something you should consider when this website will be published, it will be facilitated on your organizations, how you could get other organizations, other bad institutes involved. That's the thing we need to think about, and that's one topic for the spring to be discussed and planned, of course. It's not only discussion, we need to have something concrete to execute and to implement to the system. These were really, really good uh, answers. I liked it a lot, and if you have any comments, please, now it's the time to comment, so please, open your microphone and uh, let's have a short discussion. If there's any, any comments to add.
Nobody. It looks like nobody. Yes. So if there's no comments, so I will just reorganize my so, windows here. So. Yeah. Deci, um, nu, nu acolo treaba pentru acasă, ce aici nu um, fost interesant. So for the homework, what we liked, what we actually are planning, first of all, we have a problem that we, we, can, we are not yet able to imagine how to place all of this on the website. So they don't have the structure, basically. We want you to ask if it's possible to to make if it's possible to upload a picture and to link that picture to to the link, let's say, to the link of this website to make a connection between the so when you click on the picture to send it to the website. So they don't want to have a boring list; they want to have some pictograms. That is possible. That is totally poss possible to do. And uh, I think we should discuss this about, uh, we have a short time after this uh, training and we, and when we are on your, we are working today in a breakout room. So you are welcome to ask those questions there also. We are visiting there, but it's possible to do. If you need help for the structure, we will help you. That's, that's possible. And this picture thing is possible to do. It's it's not impossible. So if no more questions, so I will uh, introduce for your for you this uh, next assignment we will do, and it will be working in the breakout rooms, and it's basically the same idea that you were doing in personal view, but now you should do it in your own sectoral work. And uh, you should agree following things. What is the most important use for the website? That's the question we need to see. So it's this one, I believe so in Romanian. Uh, then you also should uh, think about the question how the sectoral work could make more out of the website, how you could have more benefits, how you could more accurate, have some kind of idea why we have this website. You already have a good material. It's the thing that how we put it to the website, uh, easy, accessible and uh, it's, it's containing all the information that you really want to share. Uh, and of course, it's open website. So you, we have always the thing that we have to think how this could benefit others. If someone comes to the website, how this information benefits other institutes. And the big thing on this work how you will work with the website in the next continuous use of the website, how you update it, how you will work it. And actually this is really crucial that you will do some work between this training and training in February that you will update this information to the website. It's a really crucial thing. We can support it. Uh, in February, but uh, if we want to publish it, we need, you need to do work between here. And this is planning you will do today on the next breakout room session. Uh, and the question is also why this plan is important. It's important because you need to have plan and exact task, task to do that you are able to reserve some resources, or I would say that you will be able to have some spare time to do this work. And if you have some good plan, it's easy to share the task with your colleagues. That someone will update that information, some other will update other information. 
that you are not always working together, but you are working separately and checking the results together. That's the plan. So the plan today uh, is that you will decide how your organization will make best out of the website. This is something that you check the condition of, the, of your sec, uh, this section. You check what have been done, what is needed to be done. Then you brainstorm for new ideas. And if you don't want to brainstorm, that's totally okay. If you have already some kind of, this kind of uh, content plan, it's good. And uh, after brainstorming, you will make an update plan for the site for the next month before February and a preliminary plan uh, for after February. But actually you don't need to spend lots of time for this preliminary plan. Please spend time for this plan before February. And uh, of course you need to will, you need to agree roles and persons to be involved. Most of that work we have already done, but if there are any changes, those need to be checked at this point. And after this work, we will return back to the main room. We have a short discussion on what you have done, what are your ideas, and then ESCO will give instructions how to make this kind of questionnaire for personal staff. And uh, you will make this kind of questionnaire, plan the questions, make this uh, Google form, and uh, then you decide who collects and combines this data to be analyzed. And uh, you have a plan when you will do it. And uh, as always, these training weeks, we will end with a wrap up, feedback, we will uh, do this check-in instrument once again to get data from you your, of your skills and uh, your progress in digital skills. And this will benefit you, this will benefit you, this will benefit all of us to work together for better Moldovan digital skills and better digital skills in uh, Europe and in the world together. So that's the, our plan today. And that's not for yet to do. So I will go back to here classroom and I will show what you are doing exactly today. So we have here and just a moment, I will make it a bit larger. Here we have this uh, assignment, Ideisi Planuri Sectoriale. So here is a document in Romanian. I just opened this one for me that I know what I will talk to you. And uh, here the document you will be modifying. As you see, there are one slide for each institution. So you will update this information here. And information to update is have some kind of short bullet points that, bullet points that are how you would like to use the website. Three or four ideas, five, as many as you want to, but at least three, most likely. And you could brainstorm new ideas to use the website, a couple of bullet points, and uh, then the thing what you need to do is to do this uh, plan to update the website. You should spend time to think about this. And if there's uh, any named people, just to recap and remind yourself, put the names and the roles here. Basically only names is enough. And then basically the uh, 
task to be assigned means that what they should do in the future. If you are working alone, this is something you should do later on with your colleagues in your institute. But if you are uh, multiple attendees today, you can agree it here too. But this is the thing you are doing today uh, with me. And uh, we will be visit in your rooms. We will talk with you, but basically this is something you do together. And uh, I would say that we, I just check one thing, how much time we have for this assignment. Uh, just a moment, I lost my cursor. Okay, it is close. We have prepared time until two o'clock for this one. So basically I'm giving you about 25 minutes to work in these groups. And after that, we will come back to the main room, have short discussion and move on our subjects. So Esco, please, could